Hello and welcome to Bailey Shooting. This week we're taking a look at something very special. This is from Cadex Defence. This is a CDX SS and this one's chambered in 223. It's available in a plethora of other calibres. It's a PRS style rifle as you can tell, uh, being a chassis based system, but it is absolutely stunning to look at. So, starting from the back. At the back here you've got a folding fully adjustable stock so you can adjust your cheek height as well as your length of pull and you can also move the butt pad up and down uh, to get it comfortably in the pocket of the shoulder underneath here you've got a picatinny rail so nice and simple to mount a monopod or a bag rider uh, moving forward you've actually got the folding portion of the stock which is here pop that out goes all the way around locks into position onto a detent Throughout the rifle, you've got QDs, you've got a QD here at the rear, there's one on this side, and then you can uh, obviously mount a QD cup on the fore end as well. Uh, coming further forward yet again, you've got a nice smooth bolt with around about a 60 degree throw on it. Uh, the trigger inside here is one of Kdex's own triggers. It is adjustable between being a single stage and a two stage trigger. At the present moment in time, it is a two stage. I've lightened this up to about a pound. It's got a nice flat blade trigger on there um, and it's just really nice and smooth. We've got a vertical pistol grip here, which is adjustable forward and back for getting onto the trigger position. Um, large magwell featured just here, which takes AICS magazines. So we've obviously got 223 and I've set this rifle up using 40 grain VMAX, uh, which is quite light for this twist rate, but this gun shoots them really, really well. Um, on top, we've got a 20 MOA Picatinny rail uh, on top of the seven stars action. And coming further forward, you've obviously got a full Arca fore end with Arca lock underneath, as well as M lock down the sides for adding additional weights and a stunning fluted bar line barrel. So this is absolutely lovely. So this system, as I've set it up, I've got a Wildcat Evolution moderator on the front. I'm running the MDT sight pod bipod there. Um, the only scope I'd got spare and available at the present moment in time was a Hawk Sidewinder. Uh, great scope at its price point, but this rifle probably deserves more. It will be having a, a GPO 4.5 to 27 by 50 on it, um, I believe. But for the process of this video, it'll do the job. Uh, and we'll be filming through the trigger cam on the back so you can actually see exactly what I'm doing. So overall, it's a stunning rifle. They are expensive. They are just shy of £6,000. But to be fair, for what you pay for a custom rifle with a chassis and everything else, you're basically just cutting out the middleman and getting the end product uh, as a factory finished unit. So we'll stop talking. I have zeroed this rifle at 200 yards. So what we're gonna do is do some 200 yard shots here. Like I said, I've got 40 grain 223 loaded up. Um, get nice and comfortable. I'm gonna press record on the trigger cam. So in a second, the little blue light will start flashing on the side of here and I'll know that this unit is recording the shots. So there we go. So we are now recording. So you can see through the trigger cam, you can see my gongs there at 200 yards. So we're just gonna drop a couple of shots on that top gong there. The trigger on this is lovely. Set, set currently at two stage with a, about a one pound pull. So nice and comfortable in the centre there. Wind's pushed it across just a touch. Stamped right next to each other. That'll do. It will move down to 300 yards, which is 0.6. We'll do some shots on here. I am going to go. One right for wind. Take that off. One left. We'll use that bullet mark. Target. There you go, hit on the bullet mark, which is ideal. And then we'll go 1.2. We'll try to push this out to 400 yards. We'll go on the big plate first, just see what it's doing.
as you can see there we've just literally put bullet on bullet at 400 and again three shots on top of each other at 400 yards using 40 grain uh, VMAX which I think is phenomenal so finish the recording there so as you can see this is an out of the box sweet shooting rifle as long as you do your braking procedure and everything else it will do its job and this is with a hawk sidewinder on um, if you've got any questions about these rifles or about the brand in general you can get in touch with me either through the shop give us a call messenger Instagram or Facebook and we can answer any questions about this um, this rifle is obviously set up to shoot heavier 223 so it will shoot anything from 40s all the way up to the 70 grain 223 and obviously if you're shooting long distance then that's what's going to make sense so yeah any information about this rifle any questions you've got give us a call or for stockists of these uh, rifles you can get in touch with Highland Outdoors who are the distributor and they'll tell you who your nearest stockist is so yeah I hope you enjoyed this short video and uh, we'll see you in the next one cheers